Hello everybody, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be doing a full self-care video. I feel like you guys love any sort of video I do that is about self-care. Today I'm going to take you guys along on my true self-care routine. Like, the whole thing. I'm going to be featuring some products that just make me feel good. And to me, that's self-care. When my skin feels good and my body feels good, I feel good. And I think that's the most important part. So I want to thank you, Dove, for sponsoring this video. I am so excited because we're starting off the day by taking the shower. The self-care moment needs to happen. Grab this out of my shower here. But... We are going to be using the Dove Body Love products. This stuff is amazing. I had friends staying with me this past weekend and they were like, Danielle, these Dove products are amazing that you have in your shower. I was like, you guys are using my products? I mean, they can use my products, but you know what I mean? I was like, okay, I'm glad we like it then. So the new Dove Body Love products actually have face care ingredients in them but for your body because i feel like i'm always getting this really nice skin for, for my face but then when it comes to my body i'm like wait i want those same ingredients in my body products you know so this is a two-step double moisture cleansing regimen for your body I love it. We start off right here with the pre-cleanse shower butter. So when I get in the shower and I have wet skin, I will put this pre-cleanse shower butter all over my skin. And this is going to give that pre-cleanse hydration boost to my skin. And then after I use the pre-cleanse shower butter, I'll then go in with this moisture boost body cleanser. And it has hyaluronic serum in it, which is amazing. So does the pre-cleanse as well. And I just put it all over my body. It smells so good and it lingers on your skin, which I think is amazing. After I get out of the shower, I still smell good. When you put it on your skin, it literally feels like you're putting lotion on your skin, but it's also cleansing your skin at the same time. I grew up in Florida, so moving up here to New York this past year has been very different in the sense of winter. I've never really experienced dry skin on my like body. I've had dry face problems, but I would just use moisturizer or whatever. Never had something for my body to use. So when I use these products, I find that I don't have to worry about that anymore, especially in these dry winter months. So I'm so happy I found the Dove Body Love collection here. And with ingredients such as hyaluronic serum, I know I'm getting that next level nourishment for my skin. It's truly a moisture boost. I also have this one, which is the Radiance Renew. And what I love about the Radiance Renew cleanser is it, it's exfoliating, it makes my skin feel so good, and it has peptides and vitamin C in it. So without further ado, I'm gonna start off this self-care routine with taking the shower. When I say the shower, I'm washing my skin. I'm moisturizing my skin. I'm doing a whole situation for my body, which I never used to do. I'm washing my face, I'm shaving. I'm just doing all the amazing things. I'm trying to decide if I wanna wash my hair because I actually just worked out before this. And that's definitely a part of my self-care routine for sure. Love starting my day with a good workout. I got a little acai bowl after to treat myself. So I feel good, I got a good sweat in and now I'm showering, however, my hair is not that greasy. I think I'm gonna not wash my hair, so we're gonna do a little shower cap situation. All right, you guys, I will see you after my shower. So I feel amazing. My skin feels so soft right now, so moisturized. I'll have a link down below for you guys to check out the Dove Body Love products, of course. Before the shower, I had my little waffle robe on, and now, after I'm dried off, I put on my fuzzy robe, and this one, like, goes all the way to the floor it is so warm i just lit the candles in my apartment so they're smelling amazing my apartment just has a really good vibe so next up we're gonna take my jade roller gua sha just go to town on the lymphatic drainage i'll just put a light serum all over my face and it really helps to deep puff your face so i'm just gonna put some serum on my face and go to town with that it feels so good especially if i have a headache i love using the gua sha on my temples and the jade roller it feels so good and it really helps to wake me up as well so i'm just putting a light serum all over my face this way my facial tools can glide really easily so this is my gua sha right here oh my gosh it literally feels so good i like to do it along my jawline i usually do like five strokes per area again i'm no professional <laughs> at all but this is what i've been doing i'm trying to get better about it too i always when i travel to try to bring these items with me because i don't know also just for my anxiety it feels nice to have a routine in the morning so bringing as many things with me as i possibly can always feels really nice and one thing i've also learned is when you're draining all of this out it's important to bring it down as well um because you don't want to get a headache or anything from doing that so yeah it just feels so good it feels like i'm instantly toning my face too other side 
And you can use different sides of this. Like sometimes I'll use the bigger side. Right now I'm using like this little chiseled situation. And the forehead will go up. Oh, that feels so good. And the other tool I have right here, this is actually a rose quartz roller. They have jade rollers, just a different stone. It's just like another way to kind of do it. Depends on what tools you like. You can use this little one for depuffing under your eyes. Sometimes I'll do that. Um, they're both pretty small, so I'll honestly bring them both when I travel. Um, they're so cute. I got one for my mom and she loves it. Again, this is just what I do. This is not me telling you guys what to do, but this is a part of my um, self-care routine for sure. Just feels amazing. And I've always found when I use this rose quartz roller, my skin looks super glowy after. And I think that's one of the properties um, in this rose quartz, if I remember correctly, when I bought this rose quartz roller. Rose quartz roller, <laughs> that's a tongue twister, huh? All right, so I'm gonna keep my hair up for now because I have a ton of oil on my face and I don't want my hair to get super greasy, but in a little bit we'll brush our hair, but we're gonna go out into the kitchen. I feel like a million bucks right now. Um, I'm really into drinking hot tea. I feel like drinking a cup of hot tea is like a warm hug. It just feels very soothing. If I'm just feeling kind of all over the place, out of body situation, it really brings me back. It really centers me. It's super grounding. Um, so typically I like to have a caffeine-free caffeine, caffeine -free tea. So today we're just gonna do some peppermint tea. Peppermint tea is typically really good for your digestion too. Um, it just tastes really good to me and I just make a little cup of it. I'm gonna use this little clear mug, put my tea bag in and I'm just waiting for the water to heat up. And I pour myself a nice cuppa, that's what my grandma calls it. She'll be like, do you wanna have a cuppa together, Danielle? I've always gone with the slogan, if my apartment is a mess, I'm a mess and I truly believe that to my core. When my apartment is clean and everything's in their spot, I feel so much better and I just feel so zen. And I think on these self-care days that you take for yourself, it's very, very important to kind of make sure your space around you is how you want it to be. I feel like most people would say clean and tidy. So I try to be super conscious about, you know, when I'm putting my sneakers away to like not just throw them back in, but to put them where they're supposed to go. And that's something I've definitely learned even just since moving to New York City and getting this new space. I've really just created new cleaning habits for myself so it avoids a larger mess. However, like I was saying earlier, I did have some friends stay with me this past weekend so my closet is a little crazy. Other than that, my apartment's pretty, pretty good. I did laundry last night. I might do some more today, feeling good. My living room's pretty clean right now. But as you can see, I hopped out of bed this morning. Didn't make my bed. I did clean my sheets last night, so I was proud. And my bed looks semi-tidy still. Um, and then I just have all these clothes that I just didn't put away, just hanging on the doorknob. So I wanna clean so I can just feel tidy in my space. Um, and then I'll be able to relax even more. squeaky clean right now it is sparkling it is tidy it is all the things so I can finally take my hair down I have been loving using these boar bristle brushes they're just so soft obviously I brush through my hair too because it helps with tangles but this just makes my hair so soft and shiny I don't know, I just feel like it's an instant little reboot for my hair so now that my apartment's clean and I'm clean and moisturized it's time to relax I'm gonna journal I'm gonna read I'm gonna drink my tea and do a face mask because why not? I always like to use these big headbands to keep my hair out of my face. If I could just wear these as a fashion statement every day, I would because honestly, they're so nice just having everything out of your face. I'm gonna do this moisturizing um, and hydrating face mask. It's a face, it's a 
It's a sheet mask, which I love. I love this one too, because it comes in two halves, so you can really fit it to your face. So cute, I just leave this on for like 10 minutes, or I leave it on as long as I can until it starts peeling off of my face, because I would literally just have this on forever. And then I also can just use my rose quartz roller right here. <laughs> that really is a tongue twister, um, and just kind of press it into my skin. It just feels really darn good. Then we take it to the couch, of course, I've got all kinds of goodies here. I have my peppermint tea that I'm still drinking, my quartz roller here, and then I have my everyday doing all daily journal slash planner. I like plan on one side and then on the other side I will just fill it out. Um, and then obviously I have my book right here, so I do a little bit of both. Before I start reading, I'm just gonna kind of get everything out of my head because I find if I journal or plan or just do stuff like that before I read, I'm able to focus more on the book and really just kind of take myself out of reality for a second, which is one of the reasons I read. It allows me to just kind of get away for a second. I like to put everything on paper so it kind of just gets out of my head um, and I know that it's taken care of. I'm like, okay, I wrote that down already. Um, so I kind of cheated and I already planned this morning um, because it just had to happen. But now I'm taking the moment, I'm still taking that moment to write down everything. So on the top here, I write what I'm grateful for, some affirmations that I have for the day. So today I'll probably do, I'm healthy, I am happy, I am, I am wellness, I don't know, something like that. Um, and then today's quote that I have on this is, I am not sure how, but I will. So I'll trace that. I'll write down what I'm doing for self-care, which honestly, I might not even write it down because I'm already doing <laughs> everything and more. Write down what my mood is for the day, which I feel like my mood today is very content, very thankful. And then an act of kindness, so something I'm gonna do for somebody else today. So I'm gonna sit here with my face mask on. I'm gonna put on some music, but you guys unfortunately can't hear it because of copyright. Um, I typically play one of the playlists I have made on Spotify, I'll do Coffee House, or I'll do, I really like listening to like Soft House Lounge. I literally, there's this one called Hotel Lobby that I like. Um, so, I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, that's all done. I got everything onto paper. Now, I'm just gonna kick back. Right now, I'm reading Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo. It is so good. I've got a little bit left of my peppermint tea. When I read, I either read in silence or there's this playlist called Reading Music. I'm obsessed with music. If you guys can't tell, it's just really important to me. Um, <laughs> so I'll put that on and read this. I'll usually read a couple chapters or until I'm ready. See you guys in a little bit. All right, it's a lot later now. I'm gonna peel this mask off. My skin feels super glowy, moisturized, hydrated, all over. I hope you guys enjoyed coming along with me on this little self-care adventure. I hope this inspires you guys to treat yourself to a little self-care moment as well. Thank you again to Dove for sponsoring this video. Definitely check out their Dove Body Love products. I am obsessed. I'll have a link down below for you guys. That wraps up this video. I will see you guys very soon for our next one and enjoy the rest of your day. Bye.